Marseille. And it's where we have uh, two excellent restaurants serving uh, the famous uh, dish of Marseille. Probably no, it's called the Pouya Bess. Big piece of wood, but only in the country. But it's a private uh, spa. I mean, it's uh, from plastic surgery clinic. But we call it uh, the Little Chambord because it reminds us of the Chambord that was uh, 16 out of the 18 beaches that we have in Marseille. And the water was uh, quite control as an excellent water. And when they built the metro, because we have a subway, and uh, we have also a gift shop, but you go into it three times after that. So yes. There is a lower church and the uh, RT. So it was, you'll see a lot. And this is the second largest city in France. And with the abolition of slavery, the mid-18th century, uh, the shipyard, the royal fleet, disappeared. But if you see, there's a boat crossing now the harbor, so this is the 18th century, there's the yellow buildings on the right. And uh, behind you have the uh, plaza, i just show you. And uh, it's a green anise, licorice, a lot of alcohol because there are about 45% of alcohol. So you don't drink it straight, you put one. Then uh, there is also an uh, indoor shopping mall, the Galerie Lafayette, uh, like the one in Paris earlier. So it was made uh, also for the year 2013 when Marseille was the uh, round corner. It's called La Samaritaine. And uh, next to it, you have a uh, Hagen Das ice cream place. And next to that, uh, it's called La Canelière. It's like the Champs Elysees of Marseille. And uh, we're not going, uh, we're going to be dropped off uh, just by the very go round here. So if you wanted public of a waiter, because you could spend all afternoon at the terrace of the cafe, they won't bother you. So you just say s'il vous, the toilet. But uh, if you ask nicely, but we say a uh, quarter to four. City Hall of Marseille. So this is a 17th century building. And uh, it's more a Baroque, Italian Baroque. Then we had uh, the flags of France, so it's a blue, white and red. We had the Provençal flag, it's a yellow and red stripes. And then we had the EU flag, a blue flag with 12 stars, because it was the original uh, flag from the 12 countries that were starting in Europe. So you see on the right, so this is going all day. So it's an uh, art and because there is a uh, a lot, I mean, it's a very large market. Uh, what you'll see by uh, to be soup, it's the shape. It's uh, shaped as a cube, and it has to have inside 72% of different mineral oils. So you have two types. You have the white uh, cubic soap, and this is very good for uh, hand wash. On the left, you have an old church, saint Ferreol from the 15th century, but they redone the front in the 18th century. So the white soap, they didn't have. So Louis XIV, when he came here, uh, he enclosed this new port with two forts. So we have a Fort Saint Nicholas. It was designed by the architect of the Sun King, Louis XIV. So after the front, uh, you have an island with a fortress on it. And this is called the Fortress of If, I-F. And it was known because we had the uh, French writer, Monsieur Alexander Dumas, had written a 
This is Marseille, France. Bonjour. To travel a lot around, around the Mediterranean countries, so he incorporated all the style he has seen during his travels. So on uh, the right, so this is also was uh, inaugurated uh, in 2013. So we have a black building where it's written Picasso. Uh, this is a new museum called the Muse. It means the Museum of uh, European and Mediterranean Civilization. In front you have this uh, strange design uh, building and this is uh, a conference uh, room, like a convention center all about the Mediterranean. Then we are arriving in the center of Marseille.